Hello everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel Max Magnet. In this video, we are going to learn a trick to write the trigonometric ratios of the angles from 0 degrees to 180 degrees. Okay, most of the students will get confused and they forgot how to write all these values. So, by learning this trick, you can write the, all the values within very short time. Okay, so let us start. First of all, we have to write 0, 1, 2, 3, and 4 here. Now divide all the numbers with 4. Divided by 4, divided by 4, by 4, divided by 4. Now keep square root to all the numbers. After keeping square root, simplify these values. 0 by anything, 0. Okay. Now root 1 means root 1 means 1, root 4 means 2. Now cancel these values 2 1 the 2 2 the root 1 means 1, root 2 means root 2 only. So sin 0 degrees 0 sin 30 degrees 1 by 2, sin 45 1 by root 2, sin 60. So, root 3 means we write root 3 and root 4 means 2. Now, 4, 4 will get cancelled here remaining 1. So, sin 90 is 1. By using this method, you, can, you have to write only sin. Okay, 0, 1 by 2, 1 by root 2, root 3 by 2, 1. Now, the reverse, the, when we reverse all these values, we will get cos theta. So, sin 90 is equal to cos 0. So, here 90 is 1. So, we write 1 here. Next here, sin 60 is cos 30. So, root 3 by 2. Now, similarly here 1 by root 2. Now, this value 1 by 2 will get here. Now, here 0. Okay. By reversing the, all the values of sin theta, you will get cos theta. Now, how to write tan theta? So, we know that tan theta is equal to sin theta by cos theta. So, we have sin theta and cos theta here. If you just divide these values, you will get tan theta. So, 0 by 1, 0. 1 by 2 divided by root 3 by 2 means 2 to get cancelled, 1 by root 3. Here also, 1 by root 2 divided by 1 by root 2 means, okay, all the values will get cancelled, answer is 1. Root 3 by 2 divided by 1 by 2 means 2 to get cancelled, root 3 by 1, that is root 3. 1 by 0 is infinite, okay. When you divide any number with 0, 1 by 0, 2 by 0, 3 by 0, it is infinite. Now, when you reverse tan theta, you will get cot theta. So, infinite here, root 3, 1, 1 by root 3 and here 0. Okay. Now, secant, how to write secant theta? We know that secant theta is reciprocal of cos theta. So, we have cos theta here. Write reciprocal of this one. So, divide with 1, 1 by 1, 1. So, reciprocal of root 3 by 2 is 2 by root 3. Reciprocal of 1 by root 2 is root 2. Reciprocal of 1 by 2 is 2. So, just reverse them. So, reciprocal of 1 by 0. 1 by 0 means just we return that is infinite. Now, if you reverse secant theta, you will get cosecant. Now, this is infinite 2 root 2, 2 by root 3, 1. Okay. By using this method, you can write the values from 0 to 90. Now, how to write up to 180, 120, 135, 150, 180. How to write these values? So, just remember that you have to get the sum 180. Okay. So, 120 plus 60 is 180. So, 120 is equal to 60 here. So, what are the one, uh, 60 values here? Root 3 by 2 right here. Okay. Now, 1 by 2, root 3, 1 by root 3, 2, 2 by root 3. Okay. We have written just 60 values in 120 because both are equal. Now, 45 and 135 will become 180. So, 45 is equal to 135. Now, all this value right here, 1 by root 2. Okay. Next, 1 by root 2, 1, 1, root 2 and root 2. Now, 30 plus 150 equal 180. So, 30 values equal to 150 values. So, 30 is 1 by 2, root 3 by 2, okay, 1 by root 3, root 3, 2 by root 3, 2. So, 180 equal to 0. Now, 180 is equal to 0. Here, 0 values we write in 180. So, 0, sin 0, 0, cos 0, 1, tan 0, 0, cot 0, infinite, secant 0, 1, cosecant 0, infinite. Now, finally, sin and cosecant will have positive sign, sin and cosecant will have positive sign and remaining all will have negative. So, keep minus here, negative, okay. 
now minus 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 infinite we don't write minus to zero because there is no uh, sign be before zero okay so my minus 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 so sin 120 degrees is root 3 by 2 sin 135 degrees is 1 by root 2 okay sin 150 degrees is 1 by 2 sin 180 is 0 cos 120 minus 1 by 2 cos 135 minus 1 by root 2 cos 150 minus root 3 by 2 so just i told that sin and cosecant are positive so there will be no negative sign for sin and cosecant so this is the trick uh, to write all the values i hope this video will help you thank you for watching this video